Hi, I'm Tony Fleming. Welcome to Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Hey, just pulled the hanging tag off of this uh, 07 Stores XR1200. Uh, this is the Dirt Tracker Edition. Uh, this bike has some incredible history and some great documentation with it too. I'll spend some time walking around and kind of showing you some of the features that I'm able to see. I'm sure there's a lot of other things that have done on this bike uh, that, uh, that I'm going to miss. So I apologize for that, but uh, there's so much custom work done. And this is the bike owned personally by Steve Stores. We have the paperwork to prove that. Uh, it's also the show bike. It's also the bike that has a gazillion dollars tied up in it. And uh, it's also the bike which is really cool and it makes it the best thing of all is this is what Harley bought the trademark and rights to the look of this so that they could sell their own uh, dirt tracker in these colors and they're now doing that and I think that's really cool. So uh, check this out. So anyway, so, uh, so we're talking about fuel injected V-twin, 1200 cc's, custom exhaust here by Stores, Stores billet reservoir here, billet rear sets here, up here, Suriani uh, forks with billet triple clamps, the risers are great looking. Billet reservoirs for uh, the PM brakes here. Check out this. This is really very nice. Galfer wave rotors. Look at that thing. That thing is meaty and heavy duty. PM calipers, billet also. The Casago uh, Excel rims, which are great looking with the lacing on them too. Fresh set of Metzler tires. They still have the little nipples on the sides. Goodridge brake lines. LED turn signals. I mean, this, uh, you know, we keep going. Everybody asks what this is. This is a steering dampener. What it does is gets rid of the head shake. This bike makes a lot of power and can kind of loft the front wheel if you're not too careful, if you're on the gas too hard. Uh, and what this does is keeps the handlebars from shaking like this, and it's also adjustable. As it's different say, just click it like this, and it determines how firm you want the steering to be. It's right here. More of Storrs rear sets. Billet shifter arms here, ignition here. Look at this, this is really nice. These are the Works Pro Racer rear shocks. They're fully adjustable. The settings are right here. You can also adjust the ride height if you want. The great thing about motorcycles is any amount of tilt either way definitely changes the handling. Just a couple clicks here and there and a couple turns there and there really makes uh, for a difference and it's kind of cool to see what it does to the bike when it does that. Rear calipers and Galfer rotors right here. This is all custom stores bodywork. Integrated tail section, leather seat made by Saddleman. But this is really my favorite part right here is the paint scheme on this bike. This is beautiful and this is something that Harley was not able to duplicate. It's great looking colors, great looking theme. You're not gonna see another one like it. Check out the turn signals. This is nice too. There's a separate kill switch on there, so people, if somebody, even if they got the key, they never know the Dakota Digital Dash. It's got a tachometer on it, speedometer, uh, oil pressure gauge, very nice features. You know, the fuel injection makes this very nice. It's a little chilly out today. I haven't warmed it up, but all you do is hit the key. You know, the modification of this bike make this bike, first off, when you pull up uh, someplace with other bikers, everybody wants to see what it is because it's a custom, man. Nobody's ever seen it before. But it has great reliability of a modern day bike with a fuel injection, the upgraded suspension and things like that. It's just an awesome, awesome bike to ride. And the great thing about it is there aren't any more of these. You know, Steve Stores owned this bike. This was the show bike and this is the real deal. So if you can get one, you should. You know, when we look at this bike, it's just a great looking, great looking representation of if you are if you're in America you can build whatever you want and the fact that a giant company like Harley wanted so much to have this bike in their arsenal they're willing to buy uh, the design rights from Steve stores um, talk about five speed also I'm just looking at my list here there were so many things on it I was afraid that I was going to miss something I'm not sure I did but I will say this we're very proud to present this really rare really custom bike with ridiculously low miles uh, we're Fleming's ultimate garage call us 301 816-1000, we'll tell you all about it.